Now let's talk about potential 2012 gold, a young fighter we had on this show back in 2009. He was back last year when he won ABA Super Heavyweight title, back again when he started to win for England. Well, he's back in the ABA Finals tomorrow night in Colchester. Ron Bowden mentioned him a little bit earlier on, and he's moving closer, closer, I say, to the Olympic ring. From Finchley ABC, it's Anthony Joshua. How are you, Josh? I'm feeling good, Steve. How are you? Yeah, I'm fantastic. Anthony, you're in the final against... We thought you were going to be in the final against the kid from Burton, and you're in, instead you're in the final with a bit of an unknown, this Iraqi super heavyweight champion. What do you know about him? Well, I've done my research. Is it Iranian? Iranian? Iranian. No, R- Ronnie's Iranian. Get, Ronnie gets confused like that. Um, he's a banger. Yeah, of course. It shows by his record in, in the last three contests that he's had, but yeah. um, gives me a chance to throw my abilities. You don't really mix fire with fire. No, no, true. Um and uh, obviously I'm going to go in there and use my brain it's not all about power mm-hmm. and uh, put on a good performance because you've got two you've got a brawler and a boxer in there mm. you're going to get a good show well you've, sh- you've shown yourself uh, Anthony since the novices and then through the ABAs last year then at your international levels you've shown that you can box and I know people and I, I know that I've drummed it into in other people but it's about learning still for you not showing how big your heart is and how much power you've yeah. got so, so you, it looks to me like tomorrow night about 11 o'clock you're going to have to be using your brain a little bit before you use your power, which is good. Which is good. Which is good. As I said, so I can display what I've learnt from them. Yeah, absolutely. Since last year until now. Oh, and uh, a... have, you, have, you, have you been sparring with, you know, have you been sparring with Chisora or sparring with Tyson Fury or John McDermott? Have you been mixing it with the pros, getting a bit of extra experience? I've been, I've been doing a lot of sparring, but not with the names that you've mentioned. Okay. Can you mention um, the names or is it secret? No, not a secret, but one I'd like to mention is on, my son. cousin, Ben and the Amy, the 91 KT heavyweight. That's, that's unbelievable. Yeah, so two of you from Finchley in back-to-back ABA finals. Yeah, so he, he's come on immensely strong, powerful, and, uh, you know, it's, it's perfect what I need. It's right on my doorstep, so that's been my one of my main sparring partners there. That makes that makes all the sense in the world. Now, yeah. uh, Josh, what's um, coming up in the next couple of months? There's some there's some matches potentially, some England squads, England squ- is, or England appearances. Yeah, um, ooh, Brett, ooh. Brett mentioned uh, England versus Ireland. Yeah. But you know what it is, Steve. Um, I've got my mindset on some more. You know. Yeah. Uh, there's the Olympics coming up, the Europeans, cool. the Worlds. But I just need to break through tomorrow and win this, Good. and then you know, and see what else the. Ooh. The international side want me on. Listen, it's, you know what, you know what, Josh. I've spoken to you a few times, and I can tell you more focus now than I think I've ever spoken to you. It's important. Uh, Last year was great winning. Winning the novices the year before was good. This yeah. is the big one. This is the pre-Olympic one for you. As you said, um, I'm still learning, so yeah. uh, I'm going to get in there and just do my job and do it well as well. Uh, you know listen, I mean? big Josh. I'll see. I'll come and see you before the fight tomorrow night down in uh, in, in Colchester. Anthony Joshua there. Super heavyweight champion from last year. We've been we've been pushing him, we've been banging him heavy on this show for about eighteen months, and he's a good talk. He's only about twenty two. He's a fantastic kid, a fantastic talent. My ne-